Did you know that Volkswagen has made a car with a remarkable fuel efficiency of 0.9 liters per 100 kilometers, or 260 miles per gallon? Did you wonder how Muslim astronauts pray in space, facing Mecca, facing Earth? It may surprise you to learn that there are no hedgehogs native to the United States of America. Did you know that Black Label Coffee has one of the highest caffeine content with 1,555 milligrams per 12 ounce cup? Did you know that the fingernails on your dominant hand grow quicker than the ones on your other hand? You may be surprised to learn that Walmart is one of the largest employer globally behind the U.S. Defense Department and the Chinese Army. From a 2014 survey, 11% of Americans mistakenly believed HTML is a sexually transmitted disease, 15% thought software is a type of apparel, and 18% identified Blu-ray as a marine animal. You may have heard that a nickname was once an eek name, which literally means extra name. Over time, the word was mistakenly split into a nickname. You are probably unaware that hedione, substance found in colognes, body sprays, and aftershaves, can actually stimulate female arousal. Have you been aware that there are different varieties of American Sign Language? Southern signers usually sign slower than those from the North, and Black American Sign Language was created due to school segregation. The reason why water won't help you extinguish the burning sensation in your mouth after eating chili pepper is because of capsaicin, the compound found in chilies that is hydrophobic and repelling water. There is a mathematical equation which, when plotted, generates a graph of the equation itself. Few are aware that the U.S. spends hundreds of billions of dollars annually on lawn care. A young woman once attempted to send herself to the Beatles by packing herself in a wooden crate and mailing it. Tigers, jaguars, and leopards are drawn to the scent of Calvin Klein's obsession for men cologne, which is often used to lure them to camera traps in the wild. It may come as a surprise, but the word computer was first used in the 1600s to refer to someone skilled in mathematics and calculations.